Oh, can I? Wow. Yeah, met Rowan can I a few times. What a player and an interesting guy because even though he played for the West Indies, he was of Indian sort of descent and that was really difficult in those days for those guys to so, get into the West Indian team. So there was a divide between the Indian dis- baseball background players and the, say, African base players. If you ask them, they'd probably say no. But the talk I've heard was, yeah, it was really difficult. I'll give you an example. Do you remember Larry Gomes? Oh, I used to love Larry Gomes. Right. He was Larry was Portuguese born, I think. But do you remember what Larry did with his hair? It was all like f- curly and... In the end it was. Yeah. It wasn't like that at the start, but he sort of felt he had to get oh, the afro done. Oh, so he, yeah, f- to fit in more. Yeah, yeah. And and I don't think there was – that was just a classic story that I saw unfold in front of me. And I don't think they gave it to him because he was Portuguese or he wasn't, you know, a, a West Indian, so to speak, of African descent. Yeah. But the Indian guys, you hardly – saw when I, when I toured the Caribbean in 91, particularly in Trinidad, where there's a huge Indian population, we played a game against Trinidad and Tobago and they had some of these Indian – guys of Indian names playing, they're West Indian. They go, mate, that guy's taken 600 first-class wickets as an off-spinner and could never get a game. Wow. And we just go, wow, he's bowled unbelievably today against us. And he just told us he's taken hundreds and hundreds of first-class wickets, but his name's Ravi Kanhai, yeah. and it just didn't sit well at the time. It's changed a fair bit now. Because Larry Games, he bowled some off-spin too. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he yeah. Just- yeah, yeah, he was just a classy batsman. Yeah, but Rowan was, well, there it says, he, uh, he was the first West Indies player to hit a century in each innings of a test against Australia. He made 117, 115. Yeah, wow. fine player and met him a few times in England and a lovely, lovely man, Rowan, can I? 